With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Question is, in the interference pattern produced by two identical slits, the central maximum is I. What will be the intensity of light at the same spot if one of the slits is closed? So we can see here, this is our Young's double slit experiment. Hence, we can see here at the central point, there will be a maxima, central maxima. Now, these are two identical slits. So we can see here, the, both the intensities will be same at these points. So we can see here, intensity at, let's say, both the points is same. That is, we have here as intensity I0. And we can say here, if one of the slits has been closed, so we can see here, the intensity at this point will be given here in terms of I0. So we can see here the intensity at the central maxima, we can see here is given as I is equal to, we can say as root under I1 plus we have here root under I2 whole square. So since I1 and I2 are both to be same, so we can see here that this maximum intensity is I at the central maxima given in the question. This comes as root under I0 plus root under I0 whole square. So this comes as 2 root under I0 whole square which is equal to we can say as 4 into I0. So we can see here this I is equal to 2 under root I0 whole square. Hence I value comes out to be our 4 I0. That is we can see here that 4 I0 is the intensity of light at the same spot. Let's say if let's say both the intensities emerge and if only one let's say light point goes to that point central point then intensity is i0 hence we can say i is equal to 4 i0 is the correct relation that is option number 3 is the correct answer so 3 is our answer for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today